Now let's see if we can get this pig in the air. This thing weighs, probably only weighs about 100 pounds. But that's more than enough, especially all the weights towards the, uh, the top of it. So hopefully that screw holds in there. So we're going to try to do a little brute strength and ignorance. Lift it up, set it on, try to get at least one screw enough to hold it in there, get another one ready, and <laughs> see what happens. Worst comes to worst, I'm going to drop it, but I'm not going to... We'll see what happens. I guess that's the best we can do. Screws right there. if I could pick it up from the front and get the weight closer to my body. That would be ideal. There's, there's a chip to hold on to on this thing. Let's just get one to hold it for now. Woohoo! <laughs> wow! There's one heavy pig. Beautiful. God, does that look like garbage. <laughs> oh well. Oh well. Just have to live with it.
Well, here it is. So all we have left to do, we're going to put some pieces up here to reinforce these boards. The top, I made a frame on the outside. You guys saw that earlier in the video. It's secured all the way, it's screwed all the way through the 2 by through these boards and pretty deep into here. We use some pretty long screws. Also, we did the same thing down here, back side and this side. Um, anyway, got a wire run in. We've got a temporary plug on the end to plug it in. Uh, throughout the week, we're going to have to run some conduit out here, get that worked out, and get this thing set up. But let's see how good this baby works. It's going to be loud, but it's going to be worth it. See what develops here. Not too bad. She's definitely old and a little bit whiny, but we can live with it. So let's see how well Let's see how well this thing pulls. We got a piece uh, right here. Now the cat wouldn't make an appearance. He ran away as soon as I started tinkering with this thing. I think he knew what I meant to do if I could catch him to test this thing out, but I guess we'll just have to use what we have. Well, let's see how she does. Just fine. Didn't draw even. Not too bad. We'll take that. Let's see if it'll. That'll work. I think that'll work well. So what we're going to end up doing with this, we're going to build a hood over the top of this so the smoke can collect above it. It's probably going to come out a good four feet or so. We'll see when we get to that point. We're going to line all of this with metal all the way back to here, and then we're going to seal it off with fire rated silicones. The red silicone, it's good up to like 700 degrees or something like that. And basically any sawdust or anything like that from installing it, we're going to have to vacuum out of here, although this thing kind of sucked most of it out anyway. We'll have to clean any of the grease up that's on this part in case we get an errant spark or something like that. I really don't think that's going to be too much of an issue, but we'll do it anyway. The other thing we're going to do, like I said, we're going to frame this out, but like right now I can feel a draft coming through here. So we're going to have to build a trap door with good seals on it to drop down and close this off when we're not using it. Otherwise, it's just going to make it that much colder in here and we'd really... Winters around here are cold enough. We don't need to make them worse. But uh, I'm pretty darn happy with that. I think she will work well. We'll see what happens. So thanks for watching, everybody, and I'll catch you on the next one.